what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. I got to get your top five on on these uh, the albums that you made. So let's start with Key Sweat, Make It Last Forever. You got Guy Sep Title. You got, um, you got, uh, who, who, am I, who am I missing? You got Black Street, yeah. uh, the, the Black Street uh, self titled album. Mm -hmm. You got, um, uh, who am I thinking about? Today? Today, yeah. Self titled. You got, the Bobby Brown, Bobby second Brown. album, That's where it. I have the most songs. Yeah, rank your top five. I know it's hard, but rank your top five favorites. You know, starting with number five. Number five. Number five would be today. Okay. And. Uh, Number four would be, wow, wow, that, that real, yo, wow, real right now. Real. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I have to say number four would be um, Black Street. Okay. Number three, Guy. Number two, Keith Sweat. Number one, Michael Jackson. Oh, you know, I didn't even mention the Michael Jackson album. I mean, yeah. how, how many, uh, now which album was that again? The Dangerous album. That was the Dangerous album. But yeah. uh, how many uh, records did you do on that? Seven. Oh, hell. Yeah. The seven, six, seven, seven, seven. seven. And Mike only put out like what, 10, 10, 10 songs on that album, mm -hmm. right? That one particularly, I think it was uh, 14, 12, 12 or 14. Right. Because I did, you did have, on that yeah. album, I, for that album, I did about nine, but he uh, he wanted to be politically, um, how you say, politically correct with all the different producers, but he knew that the album would center around him and I. Right. You know, he, and I didn't know for six months. I didn't know for six months if I was gonna make that album. That's the reason yeah. why I didn't do no interviews. And he just came up to me six months after making this album, making, you know, working on everything, because this dude had over 50 songs. Mm -hmm. He had over 50 songs and I was, he was like, um, can I see you in my office? I was like, um, okay. And it was one of those moments you get nervous because you think you're gonna be fired or, or, you know, something, you know, yeah. happened. And he was like, I just want to say to you, um, no, first I want to ask, why you don't talk about us? I said, what, what do you mean? He said, you don't do interviews. I was like, I don't do interviews because you got a dog on 50 page contract. That's a dog on NDA. Right. Non disclosed. I know what that means. Right. So, I'm not going to do no interviews and say, unless you say, you know, because this is yours. This is your shit. I'll do interview if you say do interviews. But you never told me to do interviews. You never say talk about us. You gave me a non-disclosure with no explanations behind it. Like no rules or no whatever. You didn't, right. in there it says do not disclose anything. You know what I'm saying? Right. So I didn't disclose us. So he's like, he started laughing. And he's like, man, I would, with you, you, you can talk about us. Eric, you can tell your family. It doesn't matter because you're like, you're my new friend. You know, you, we, we built something here. It's six months. Right. You got to go out and talk about us. I want people to know about this album. I want people in, a, in your community to know. So that's why I started doing interviews. And he was like, this is great. Now I'm going to get you Rolling Stones and I'm going to get you this. And I started being in all these magazines I never even heard of. You right. know, I did all the fanzines, you know, like right on what we do, Jot, mm -hmm. uh, Jet, you know, the, right. the black magazine. Right. But he got me in all of the 
like the Rolling Stones, the vibe and all of that. And Quincy got me in vibe. I had a centerfold and and all of these magazines and, and TV shows and morning shows that he put me on. And that's when I, I truly seen the true fame. That's when I truly seen the limelight and, and uh, met a lot of people, you know, and, and I started working with Jimmy Iovine and, you know, and Dre. So that's when I started seeing everything. What the talking about?